Hi, I'm Matt Chenard, Senior Waterfowl Programs Manager for Delta Waterfowl, here with our last migration report of the spring. To start things off, let's hear from Kyle Winterstein in the Atlantic Flyway. Thanks, Matt. Here in Pennsylvania, the snow goose hunting was strong for the first half of March, but for the last seven to 10 days, we've really been shedding a lot of birds and now find ourselves sadly at the tail end of the migration. Uh, there's still pockets of birds around, including a couple thousand at the Middle Creek Wildlife Management Area in the southeastern portion of the state, but really it's hunters in New York who are still reporting good hunts and increasingly the hunters in Ontario are faring quite well. So by the looks of it, the peak of the snow goose migration in the east is right at the Canadian border. And uh, while we are winding down here in the middle Atlantic US, if you are in the Great Lakes region of Eastern Canada, it is go time for you. Thanks Kyle. Here in the, in the central and Mississippi flyways, we're hearing snow goose reports all over the map. Uh, just this past week, we heard reports from Northeast Arkansas that there were still pockets of juvie snow geese there and enough of them for, for some good hunts. But for the most part, the bulk of the snow geese are now north of Missouri and the peak numbers are actually in South Dakota. Uh, last week at Sand Lake, Sand Lake National Wildlife Refuge, they had nearly a half a million snow geese there and I suspect they're probably gonna stick around that area for a while as we have really cold temperatures here in North Dakota and quite a bit of snow. There are some Canada geese here, but for the most, most part, the snow geese are still in South Dakota and, and points further south. Um, we've heard good reports from snow goose hunters in southwestern Minnesota, northwestern Iowa, and in Nebraska. You might have to put on a few more miles there to find the geese, but, but they're there and uh, available for hunters. For a report from western Canada, let's hear from Emily Lamb. Hey everybody, uh, once again, as you can see, really nothing new to report up here in Prairie Canada. We're seeing temperatures as low as minus 27 degrees Celsius still, um, about three feet of snow. A couple snow geese showed up in southern Alberta yesterday and uh, turned right around and were nowhere to be seen this morning. So across Prairie, Can or Prairie Canada, uh, BC, Alberta, Saskatchewan, uh, Manitoba, we're really not seeing any action. Although it looks like here in the next few days, um, they've been thinking about coming up. So uh, happy hunting and hopefully we get at it in the next few weeks. Thanks. Thanks, Emily. Well, as you've heard, the spring conservation season for snow geese is kind of winding down for some folks and just starting up for others. Hopefully you've had the opportunity to get out and hunt snow geese while they were in your area. That's it for our April migration report. We'll start with our fall migration reports in August, but check back on Delta's social media accounts regularly for other great uh, info and stories.